Rick Pacino, and JR Carr. It's an eight-car field, so we're going to put him down with Ethan Arrow. On the left side, Johnny Pacino with a Ford Mustang. Little bow tie versus blue oval mountain. Johnny Placino's 300 reaction time advantage. So on to the semifinal for JR. Missed it a little on the first 60 feet at one second 60 foot time, but a little bit better than that throughout the weekend. I think that's where they lost. Did his job. Gonna be last to stage. And John DeFlorian, 628-5-224, wins the race, takes out Tony Gillen. Final that six. Seven. They were both all over the racetrack down there. Moving around, moving left, moving right, moving left, moving right. Tommy Lee is able to keep the lead. You come out, you weren't at Indy, but you beat the Indy winners. Got to feel good, round one. Round one was good. We're, we're happy. We struggled in qualifying, didn't qualify on top, you know, or closer to the top. Had a little issue, figured it out, and ran out there. 626 today is a good run. So we're happy, and uh, go to the next round and see what we can do. Well, you know,
hundredths of a second. We got 800 plus cubic engines. We got brute torque. We got a couple of guys that are used to doing this. We're on the PDRA and other sanctions, getting a chance to come out here and do it. In front of you great fans at Z-Max. Final two cars. Our car, John DeFlorian, 629, 223 miles an hour, and that's just not quite enough. Congratulations, man. Thank you. Appreciate it. Yeah.